seven, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. What's going on everybody? I hope you're having a great day. I hope you're making the most out of your day. My name is Connor Gall. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to the vlog. Guys, I am out here on the uh, the pier because this is going to be one of our last times to hang out on the pier on this channel because I'm moving. Aww. The reason for that is the world race. Um, as things keep progressing towards August and then October when I launch, uh, I just got to like you know, keep cutting down payments and I can't afford to keep paying rent. Uh, this family has been extremely kind to me, they're amazing, but decided to go home, spend some time with my family as well, just before I peace out for a year. And uh, yeah, so moving next week. Now, I wasn't planning on making this like a sentimental or tribute to this location, this house, North Carolina, or even Eufaula Baptist Church, where I've been going to church for the past eight or nine months. Uh, but it's hard not to get nostalgic whenever you're like talking about leaving and it just seemed like yesterday that I got here and so much has happened and it's going to happen. It's just, you know, it's tough. So I'm going to take you inside. It's a little bit messy like usual and uh, we're going to pack our stuff up, go to the church because we've got a lot to do today. I will forever remember this place as my little treehouse apartment. I mean, isn't it just so like cute and quaint and cozy? A lot of memories here, and uh, yes, I know, it's a mess. But, to my credit, like I am packing, I am getting everything together, so the messiness has a decent explanation this time. And I just finished a vlog, you guys will have already seen it, uh, last week's video. Uh, also, tell me what you think about the new, like, intro. Let me know what you think, I'd love to hear your opinion. Okay. <laughs> Pig. Caleb, where are we I, going? Where are we going right now, dude? We're going to Dollar General to get some cream. Yeah, so we can get some pies <laughs> face, All right. So the whole reason why I came here early today is because I'm doing this fundraiser for the World Race, where for every ten dollars raised, we get I get the teenagers at you full to pie me in the face. So we're going to buy the the pies or the shaving cream now. That's where we're headed. Oh, Hayden. Hey. Hayden's back on the vlog. He's here visiting. You guys remember him from last week? Yeah, buddy. What do you think about me getting pied in the face? I think this is the perfect opportunity for him to get pied in the face. <laughs> it probably never ever happened then. <laughs> it's gonna be great for everybody but me. Okay. Uh, you'll enjoy it. Okay, Bible study is completed. Now it's time for the pie in the face. We got the Bible study crew. The last Bible study. What's going on? How do you guys feel about the last Bible study? Really excited. Oh, I you're mean. You're excited. You're excited. You're, ex you're excited that I'm leaving, Tabitha. All right, so this is 30 oh God, pies. Our number is 64 because we raised 640 dollars for the birthday okay. fundraiser. It's a lot of shaving cream. <laughs> Are you guys ready to pie me in the face? <laughs> yes. Yeah. You guys excited? Yeah. No? Dude, yeah. 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 Dude, it's about to happen, man. I'm really nervous. They're really excited. <laughs> Looks good, right? I'm hoping that it's not frozen because I'll feel really bad. Um, this is awesome. Thanks, dude. <laughs> this is awesome. Guys, we raised 640 plus dollars. That means we're about to pie Connor with 64 something cakes. It's going to be awesome. Pies. So happy birthday, Connor. This cake's going in your face. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh no! I have to my That was so 
I almost broke my neck. <laughs> this is the most humiliating thing I've ever, I've ever experienced. Here we go. After you. Any future world racer who's thinking about doing a pie to the face, just understand what you're getting into. It may not be gentle, and it might be like very difficult to breathe. So just just be aware of that. I totally forgot about my phone. That's not that bad. That's not too bad. Look at that. Who's that? Hi. Emerson. Can go with that? Who's that? Do you not recognize me? Go get Colt. He's like you're covered in um, white stuff. <laughs> <laughs> post uh, post pie in the face thoughts. Have a game plan for your cleanup. I didn't. I wildly underestimated the amount of shaving cream and pie that was going to get all over me. And this water is really cold. <laughs> I don't have a towel. I do have a change of clothes. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's cold. So guys, this was my vacation. And I had the privilege of seeing this guy <laughs> pie in the face. It was just random that he was here tonight, the night that I get pie in the face. He's a big help. The camera guy, right I'm, here. I'm pretty sure that was Providence. He was, he was stellar. That was um, awesome. I would, Hayden, if you had a uh, YouTube channel, I would plug your channel. But I will plug your Instagram. Instagram right here, link below. In the, in, yeah, you know where it's at. This concludes Pie in the Face World Race Honor Ball 2018. Peace! Hey guys, it's uh, it's me again. I just wanted to make a quick outro letting you know that my nose is not broken, uh, my neck has fully recovered from the whip whiplash it suffered, and that all in all, I'm okay. I think I had cake in my ear for like two days after that, but everything is good. I hope you enjoyed watching that video. We definitely had a really fun time making it. I think some of the kids had more fun than, uh, than others. Like literally, I think the final pie count was over 80 pies because we had 64 that went super fast. Then kids just started grabbing shaving cream bottles and making more. So all in all, it was a really successful night, a really successful fundraiser too. Like the final count, a couple days after we closed the the GoFundMe, like money was still coming in. So the final count was over $700. Guys, over $700 in just a few days. And that actually puts me past my first fundraising benchmark. We exceeded $5,000 and we're two whole weeks ahead of schedule. That just blows my mind and makes me so thankful and appreciative to everybody who gave for that fundraiser, to everybody who's given to my World Race Fund as a whole, and to everybody who's prayed for me and encouraged me along the way. It literally means so much. We have, we've made some awesome progress. We still got some work to do, but man, it's awesome to be past $5,000. You guys are amazing. Again, thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're not already a subscriber, then go ahead and smash that subscribe button in its preferable face. Sorry for this guy, my neighbor, who's weed eating. So we'll go ahead and end this video by saying, we'll see you next time. Peace.